I'm Mike Peterson, a Hawke's Bay farmer and also New Zealand's Special Agricultural Trade Envoy. The opportunities for the New Zealand primary sector in a world that's hungry for high quality protein and fresh produce are enormous. Hawke's Bay is at the leading edge of this opportunity and is ideally poised to capitalise on these trends going into the future. The Hawke's Bay Primary Sector Awards are an opportunity to bring a range of awards from across the primary sector together and to celebrate success and the achievers within the sector. The primary sector plays such a key role in the Hawke's Bay economy and so it's really important that we see people involved in the awards are celebrating the success and also really highlighting the achievers in this district that contribute so much towards the primary sector and the district as a whole. We have the Silver Fern Farms Hawke's Bay Farmer of the Year supporting and celebrating the best sheep and beef farming business in Hawke's Bay. We have the Laurie Dowling Memorial Award which recognises service by an individual in Hawke's Bay. And we also have the Lawson Robinson A&P Scholarship that provides the opportunity for someone studying in the agricultural tertiary sector to really get a chance and a leg up for their tertiary education. The Hawke's Bay Farm Forester of the Year which is about promoting the forestry sector in Hawke's Bay, which is a critical part of the area. We also have the Primary Sector Industry Leader Award, which is an award that recognises the contribution and success of an outstanding individual from right across the primary sector in Hawke's Bay. Farming is an incredibly diverse business these days. We're now seeing much more focus on environmental performance, and so with that comes the need to fence off riparian strips, and also much more opportunity for forestry. The Hawke's Bay Farm Forester of the Year will, I'm sure, be running an incredibly diverse business, but with a real focus on high quality trees. Innovation has been at the heart of the success of the Hawke's Bay primary sector. Whether it's in horticulture or livestock farming, New foragers like plantain and chicory have really set alight the sheep, beef and dairy sectors. It's a great opportunity to put your farm up against others. A great way for you to benchmark what's happening within your business. And if you win the Silver Fern Farms Hawke's Bay Farmer of the Year, there's no doubt you're up there with the very best that we have. Not only in New Zealand, but on the global stage. It's rigorous, there's no doubt about it, but it's also incredibly rewarding. Then there's the awards night and if you are the lucky recipient, there will be field days as well and so the Silver Fern Farms, Hawke's Bay Farmer of the Year, hosts a field day on their property and it's been one of the draw cards on the farming calendar. The winner of the Silver Fern Farms, Hawke's Bay Farmer of the Year, has to be more than just a good financial performer. It's about a range of factors including how farmers look after their staff, what's the environmental performance like and also how the animals and livestock policies are looked after. It has to be the all-round package, it has to be an all-round performance and certainly we've got plenty of good examples of those in Hawke's Bay. The Hawke's Bay Primary Sector Awards are our opportunity to celebrate success and promote excellence in the primary sector in Hawke's Bay. I would encourage everyone, whether you're an entrant, a supporter or a sponsor, to get in behind this event and really help us showcase what Hawke's Bay has to offer. <laughs>